Looking for something in particular? Um, a pretty little trinket. Want to give someone a present? When I was last in Novigrad, I had my share of troubles. So I heard. A few people helped me then. Others, not so much. Now I mean to repay them both. Coming with? Lead the way. We need to go to Temple Isle. Don't remember you being religious? Nor am I now. Let's go. Almost there. Where are we going exactly? To see Horson Jr. Bit late for that. He's dead. I asked Sultan, and he said Horson's alive and well on Temple Isle. I was there, stuck a sword in his gut. Your hand must have slipped, because it seems he's recovered. Why are you doing this again? I want to look him in the eyes. What then? I don't know. Depends what I see. What am I to do now? Make imp shit in your stupid trap. What? Here to see Mr. Wiley. Mr. Wiley's expecting important guests, so bugger off, you... you... Chance! Make a deal, maybe? Uh... Yeah... Yeah... A deal. Go on upstairs. Boss is waiting. That was... Strange. To say the least. I wonder what they're doing. We'll know soon enough. Finally found your little ward. Took your sweet fucking time. Seems in fine health to me. Ah, because you thought you killed me that time. Surprise the fucking prize. Shut your trap, witch! Before somebody fills that owl for you. Enough! I'll finish what you started. Whoa, whoa, stop! It's me, Dudu, Dudu Bieberfell. You really didn't recognize me? Dudu? Wait, Siri. After the heist, after Dijkstra's vault was emptied, you vanished. How'd I find you? Quick. Butcher's Yard, the Mama's Plate, Priscilla's. You dragged me onto the stage. Sheathe your sword, Siri. It's doo doo. Gods! You give me quite the scare. Not wise to play games with a Witcher. Horson Jr.? Was there no one else you could impersonate? Once we'd fled, I'd no idea what to do. I could only hide for so long. They'd find me sooner or later. It wasn't our decision. We knew he was dead, but not many others had caught on. That was my chance. No one mourned for Horson Jr. In all his miserable life, he'd never helped a soul. Amusingly, once dead, he became a useful member of society. They say everyone deserves a second chance. Seems true enough. Orson got his, in a way, sharing it with a Doppler named Dudu. That was courageous, Dudu. I'd never expect it from you. Neither would I. Oh, by the way, you've no idea at the relief I feel you're alive and well. And I'm relieved I didn't slit your throat.
Time's up. Right. We must still go by the Golden Sturgeon. It was nice to see you both. And take care of yourselves. You too. So long, Dudu. Gave you a chance. Should have taken it. I spit on anything you give me. You'll regret that, you cow. Mind your manners, you're talking to a lady. Stay out of this. This is not your concern. Draw your weapons. Let's get this over with. Whoa! What? You're out to hurt her. I won't let you. So we'll argue and swagger and have who knows how long a pissing contest. I don't have time for that. Draw your swords. Say more determined this time. You shouldn't cross them, I told you. I'm to bar non-humans from this establishment because some thugs threaten me. Not likely. It's so good to see you, B. And you, Siri. Who's your charming companion? Geralt of Rivia. Very nice to meet you. I've heard so much. Really? What, for example? For example, how you've saved her from woes so many times she's lost count. And how you always know how to make her laugh. That's Siri, of course. Other ladies, however. B, I'm standing right here. <laughs> all right, all right. So, what brings you here, darlings? I wanted to thank you for everything. Oh, stop. Anyone would have done the same in my shoes. Not many would have done it with such courage. Thank you. This is for you. A trinket to remember me by. Oh, my. It's beautiful. Thank you. So, will you stay for stew? And keep slaughtered a piglet this morning. Thanks. But we must still visit Far Corners. Ah, off to see Valdo, eh? Well, shan't stop you then. They'll feed you properly there too, no doubt. Farewell to you both. And do take care of our Witcher. I will. So long. Siri, you devil incarnate, where have you been? Come here, darling. Hello, what's this? Brought your granddad? Agar, you're incorrigible. Allow me to introduce Geralt of Rivia. Ah, greetings. We've heard heaps about you. Likewise, and thanks for helping Siri. Oh, we had no choice. Found it hard to refuse a lass like her. Well, good you're here. Come in the nick of time. Would have been gone by tomorrow. You're leaving? Better start resettling non-humans shortly. We'd rather stay ahead of events. I understand. Problem is, we just lost two horses, and another two are too weak to haul anything. Ah, we'll manage somehow. We don't leave till tomorrow, so naught to worry about today. Yes, for some. I'm off to see a merchant. There's a chance I can trade our nags for a healthy horse. Wouldn't want Valdo to have anything to worry about tomorrow. Hmm. Any way we can help? Oh, don't fret about us. We always get by somehow. Right, Siri? What brings you here? I've come to apologize. I disappeared so suddenly, then... Ah, oh, pish posh. What matters is you're back, and you're well. This is for you. All that you loan me, plus a small premium. Siri, you know I can't take this. And you know I shan't let you refuse. I know. We'll make it the pot for a wager. <laughs> Do you still race? Of course. Then I challenge you. Geralt, will you join us? 
Gladly. A man after my own spirit. <laughs> Come. Geralt, choose one of these. Coming, coming. No use doing any work in this rain. Go, go. You were faster once! Giving you a head start. You're trailing. Watch where you're going or you'll fall. <laughs> Seems you've slowed. Just want to admire you from the side. Take it easy. Can still beat you. I let you win. Lovely race. Well, this calls for a celebration. Stay the evening. We have several barrels of Kedwin's best. Bonfires to be lit soon, round which all will gather. This night shall be ours. You know, perhaps it's not my concern, but... I'm glad you and Yennefer have ended up together. Me too. You took your time. <laughs> Guess we both needed a while to grapple with it. So, what was it like? You know, when the wish lost its hold? What did you feel? Hmm. Well, there we were, the two of us, on the mountaintop. I looked at her and... and felt like I was exactly where I was supposed to be, at long last. More wine? Thanks. I'm glad we stayed. Me too. They like you here. I like them too. Oh, I'd love to join them. Drink and race, travel from town to town. Not worry a whit about anything. Something worrying you now? What awaits us? Defeating the hunt won't be easy, but with the Lodge's support, Avalax, we can do this. I fear fighting the hunt will only be the beginning, for me at least. What do you mean? <laughs> you promised! Jest. Sometimes I wish I could be like them. Me too. Being a witch is a burden sometimes. As is my inheritance. I'd so like to be ordinary. is yours exclusively. You choose who you are. Geralt, you know that's never been true. All because of this damned elder blood. My gift. My curse. You granted me all of these powers, but it's also why I've spent my life fleeing, hiding. Then it's time to end this. Once we defeat Eredin, you'll be free. Really? Eridin's hardly alone. There are others. They have plans for me. It was the sorceresses of the Lodge once. Now it's my father. Even Yennefer. You're forgetting Avalach. Avalach's different. He is intent on my gift not falling into the wrong hands. Not spinning out of control. It's why he teaches me, protects me. If you say so. You doubt it? There'll come a day when Avalok will ask you for a favor. Perhaps. 
But if so, it will be a very, very long time from now. And I'm certain whatever it is, he'll give me a choice. I will have the option to refuse. Hope you're right. That's Pablo. I plan to learn how to juggle one day. Incredibly useful skill. Finally found you two. Enjoying yourselves. Bonfires, wine, jugglers. What more could you ask for? I could name a few things I'd trade it for, but it's a life. You seem concerned. Things not go well with the merchant. <laughs> Lost cause. The man refused to trade. I said I'd buy. He asked three arms and a host of legs for one healthy animal. We need horses, but we'll have to find another way to get them. Ho, ho, I sense trouble. I knew you'd warm to the notion. We mean to sneak into the man's stable. With 30 head, a few more or less won't make a difference in his life. Coming with? Of course. What can I do? Gotta help those in need. Yes, yes, yes! Must say, you didn't seem the type to me. What type? Steady. Time to go. We'll meet by the stables. Try to get inside. All right. That girl.
Woohoo! We did it! Excellent work! Did you see the two fools who tried to chase us? Almost tripped over their own boots. <laughs> Thanks, Geralt. That was splendid. Yeah, a nice change from killing monsters. Thanks for your help, and for visiting. It was so good to see you all again. Hang in there, and take care of yourselves. Don't forget us. So long. I must bid Valdo farewell. All right. See you at Dandelions, then. Got some things to take care of in town. See you, Geralt. Buy you a drink? I'm afraid the dishwater's as good as it gets in this establishment. Imlareth, was that your idea or Ceres? Mine. Lying didn't always come so easily to you. If you intend to... I was about to say, it's nice that you protect her. And you did the right thing to go with her. Be angry. Angry? Why? Because you supported Ciri in her decision? Or because you fought by her side and won? What if we'd lost? We wouldn't be having this conversation. And the female part of the continent's population would be drowning in tears. You won. No point bothering with what ifs. Talk to Triss. Reconvening the lodge? It's not going so well. Dangerous times, especially for sorceresses. Each thinks five times before sticking her neck out, and I can't blame them. Hmm. Charming place. Why are you here? You'll find out soon. In the meantime, tell me about Philippa. Triss and I found her and freed her. It turned out Dijkstra had her, but the situation's under control. That's a relief. So, gonna tell me why you're here? I was able to establish Margarita's whereabouts, the prison in Oxenfurt. I also learned the identity of the man who escaped from there. He should arrive shortly. What do you know about this fugitive? I know he's the only one ever to escape from Derard. Every guardsman in the city now seeks him. Sure he can be trusted? We'll soon find out. He just walked in. Abbe Faria? Who's asking? We'd like to talk. Damn! <sighs> Best run and get him. walk. Thought you'd agreed to meet. I said I'd found him, not that I'd spoken to him. What do you want from me? Let me be! Calm down, we just want to chat. Uh -huh. And then stick a shift between my ribs, leave me in the gutter. Look at us. Do we look like bandits to you? Uh, no. No, not really. I'm glad you agree. Besides, you'd be worthless to us dead. So you... you shan't hurt me? No. You're gonna tell us your story, then be on your way. Uh, oh, so be it. But we, uh, we really ought to go back to Kate's. It's unwise to linger in the street.
Drink up. It'll help. Thanks. What do you want? To get into Derard. Huh. Find a hunter. Tell them you practice magic. They'll, they'll lock you up lickety split. We need to get in without anyone noticing. Tell us how you escaped, then get on with your life. They say Dayrod's better guarded than the keep at Vicovaro. We choose the guards from among witch hunters. The worst dregs. Rabid fanatics. If you only knew what they do to folk. Torture every day. The wheel, the rack. We only knew peace on holidays when they'd drink themselves blind. They're allowed to drink on duty? Not, not officially, but you know how it is. They say no one gets out of Dayrod alive. Aye, uh, so they say. I thought, why not try it dead? But they burn the corpses. They didn't start burning them until they learned an old fellow like myself had escaped. Before, they dropped the stiffs into a great pit. The pit's connected to the sewers, and the sewers empty into the river. And once you reach the river, you're as free as a fish. So you played dead. No one caught on? As a youth, I'd apprenticed with an apothecary in Silverton. Learned a thing or two about herbs. Sleeping mushrooms grew on the walls of my cell. And I found Belladonna in the prison yard. Just had to mash them together and eat the pulp an hour before evening rounds. You might have lost your life. I prefer to die on my own terms were that to be my fate. So theoretically we could get in the way you got out. Assuming we don't mind the company of decomposing corpses. And assuming you can squeeze through the grate. They barred the outlet to the river after I escaped. Huh. Explosives could take care of that. For half the city to hear us? I have a better plan. Oxenfurt was built on elven ruins. Which have to connect to the sewers somewhere. If we can find a way into the ruins... We'll get into the prison. See? Wasn't so hard. One last bit of advice. Find a new tavern. Everyone here knows you. Thank you. Whatever your plans. I hope they work out. So do we. So long. <laughs> what he said about the guards could prove handy. True. Things will go more smoothly if we can get even a few of them drunk. Zoltan ought to manage it. I'll ask him. Let's meet on the Oxenfurt Bridge. Got a snake's tongue as well. You were vulgar one. Witcher. What should I do? Load a wagon with as much Mahakamut as you can find and drive it to Oxenford. Yennefer will give the signal. We'll drive through the gates and treat the guards. Oh, these are terrible times. Since the mage has left town, the hunters have taken to harassing non-humans. A dwarf flinging around the prison gates only stands to attract attention. Right. Didn't think of that. I'll go straight to Yen in that case. She went to find a way into the ruins beneath the city. Talking to you, Sultan. Find a way in. Several. Nearest is through a well not far from here. Did you arrange any help? We'll manage on our own. Shall we begin? Let's do this. Have we not met before? In Lock Point. Sure the guards don't know about the passage through the ruins? Haven't planted sentries there?
they haven't. How can you be sure? Novigrad's hierarchs have taken great care to eradicate any and all memories of the city's elven roots. Even if anyone remembers the ruins are there, they have no recollection of how far and where they extend. And I'm absolutely certain no one is thought to place sentries there. Hope you're right. Long live, This is it. Hmm. Baldur was plugging the well until recently. Due to an edict Hemelfart issued some years ago. But I managed to find two brawny and obliging passers-by who agreed to remove the impediment. For a modest fee, naturally. Here. What is this? Use it once you find Rita. I'll be able to pinpoint your location. See you inside, then. Good luck. Wet clothes. Oh, joy. Just you wait. The witch hunters will see to you. This one liked elven stuff. This will come in handy.
Margarita. Who? Who's that? Geralt. God, I'm hallucinating. Getting you out of here. It's pointless. He'll never open it without the key. The warden keeps them with him at all times. His room is upstairs. Be right back. What are you doing? Yen insisted on coming. Rita, what have they done? When I get my hand. 
hands on those whore sons. I'll gladly help. If I live to see it. I must take her from here. Immediately. I can't pass through the portal with you both. You'll need to get out on your own. Don't like portals anyway. Go.